So we are on season 7, episode 19, second to the last episode before PLL ends. I hope you enjoy my reaction and my little recap after. And yeah, don't forget to like and subscribe for more because I am reacting and recapping to all of the episodes till the end. Uh, yeah, I'm ready for answers, but yet. I'm sad that this show was ending. Yeah, let's just get to the reaction. I tell you, that was not the real Spencer in that scene. Oh no. How did they not smell his decaying body though? In the trunk. <laughs> of course. Close call, Aria. No, she's not. Oh boy, she's not. She's not. Something will pop up in the in the back seat. Good. Glad you agree. Okay. The board game is gone because AD took it. Time for Pi B there. Why is there a Pi reference? You're trying to make Ezra look suspicious. What's the gift? If I can, what is it? The Lost Woods? I put the deed in your name, yours and Allison's. Why? I know what's happening. Something to change everything for you and Allison and your friends. Oh. What a great mother-daughter moment. <laughs> Drake doesn't seem that all that bad now. I'm not sure it's gonna happen all over again. Instead of a family, it's gonna- I won't let them hurt you. Oh. Emily's so good, man. She's so good. What the heck? Is that like some gas leak? She's gonna turn herself in? Oh! How did you tap to the transmitter? I can take the blame. First of all, I'm not interested in you making any more stuff. Two Crows Diner. I haven't seen this place in a while. And who's Mona meeting up with? You guys are arguing like you're married or something. <laughs> Oh, why? Caleb. Oh, Caleb ruined it. Hey, Caleb, you're not supposed to be in the ladies' room. Climbed out the window. Is there some passageway? Oh, wow. Why is there some random secret passageway at this diner? How do you like the ladies' room? Body in the trunk of your car. No, I didn't forget that. <laughs> oh god. Do they not lock the trunk? Do they not lock their cars? Oh, here's the scene. Here's the scene. Okay, this has to be a dream. He's coming for you. We oh, have to go. Shoot. Now, Allie. Ah. Allie, we came back for you. So it's a dream. Because none of this makes sense. This has to be her nightmare. Oh my god, what the heck? Oh, it was Emily's dream. Oh man, what a nightmare. Oh, don't have a lot of time. Don't have a time. the NAT video. Don't have a lot of time. Don't. Shut up. <laughs> There's a lot of comical moments in this it. episode. Pick a place to be. They don't have reception down that hole. Why is Mona being all weird and nerdy again? Charlotte, I'm Hannah. The, uh, the loser, the pigtails, and the floppy sweater. Cause I see her. Is Mona Charlotte's killer, is what I'm guessing. What, Mona's gonna push her off? I won't let you do that to my friends. It's mine. <laughs> Screwdriver? Believe me. Oh, sweet Mona. You don't have the guts. Oh snap! Mona killed Charlotte. Not in this 
And what's wrong with Nerdy Mona all of a sudden? There's the puzzle. Because she really did kill Charlotte. And Carol. Oh, my Aunt Carol? What? Oh my god. Okay, it leads back to Charles here. Wow. Wow. They're always guys, digging guys, up graves. Nobody wants to do it, Aria, but we have to. True. Because there's gonna be someone videotaping them, digging that up, and it's never gonna end. So, good on you, Arya. Who's driving the tractor? Oh, snap. You ladies? Mary? What is she doing here? I killed Archer Dunhill. <gasps> She's taking the blame. I I buried his body in the woods. Did you murder Jessica De Laurentiis? That's how evidence. The glass fragments. Man. So you're just gonna let us go? Ends with theories that might be true. Guilty of at least one homicide. She did kill her sister. And that's enough to send her where she They just are just getting away with it, man. And Mary Drake literally took the blame. Oh my god. It shows how much Mary Drake cares for Spencer, Alice, and all of the other girls. <laughs> I don't know why I'm crying. <laughs> like, man. Like, here we are, all thinking that she's like a horrible woman, terrible, but. Man. Up with nothing. How does that make you feel? You know what it's like to be really afraid. The way Ooh. you made us feel. Okay, oh, she didn't. Okay, she didn't. That's what dying tastes like. Get used to it. Ooh! Oh snap! Oh, oh. 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 oh! oh! Ouch! Mm. Weapon is because they were looking for something hidden. It was right there, all the time. Congratulations! And the game is be careful. Done. We still don't know who did this. I know. Well, it wasn't Mona. It's, it's, it's just twin. They have nothing left to threaten us with. Hey, right, let's get out of here before things get too mushy. <laughs> and who's driving? We find out next week who's this person driving off to the sunset. No more secrets. What is going on? I can't bury Ezra. Huh? Wait, can't marry Ezra or can't bury Ezra? Is she saying can't marry Ezra or can't bury Ezra? I can't really make out what she's saying. If someone can tell me in the comments what she's saying, that'd be great. <laughs> Melissa! The two-hour series finale. I never would have guessed it was you. Plus the A-list rap party. Our first finale of the Watch it live. Holy shit. So Ren shoots somebody in the episode. Excited. I hope it's good. It looks good from the promo, but sometimes, you know... We all, we all know, sometimes the promo make it better than the actual episode, but it looks good, you know, the finale. This is the series finale, so, ah boy, I'm crossing my fingers. You know, it seems like Mona's in an institute of some sort again, and she, I guess AD reveals him or herself, so I guess she doesn't know who AD is. And that person seems really big, and I know they use like stand-in sometimes to throw us off, so could be that but that person looks huge to me okay so that episode it was all right for me it was a little like I guess predictable in a way because I had a feeling that Mona killed Charlotte but she didn't push Charlotte off the bell tower so who did that and I know Mona's not AD they're trying to make us think that though with her being like crazy or having split personalities it seems like I mean because we've seen that side of her and she's, you know, kind of gone back into her high school nerdy Mona again because, you know, I guess of her thinking about, you know, what happened to Charlotte and Charlotte was telling her that she still sees the nerdy Mona. So I think her thinking about that made her, you know, go back into that um, side of her. She didn't mean to kill Charlotte. I don't think so. She was just, you know, like standing up for herself, like, because, you know, Charlotte was taunting her, like, oh, you're not, you don't have the guts to do this. 
and you, you know like I still see you as nerdy Mona type of thing so you know she just wanted to scare her and taunt her but she ended up killing Charlotte the whole deal with Mary Drake taking the blame like wow she really cares about Spencer like I got teary-eyed I cried over that scene like you guys saw me it just shows how much she cares for Spencer and feels bad you know about you know what happened with Spencer's whole childhood and life and all of that like man her taking the blame I mean now we got confirmation that she really did kill Jessica because that was you know when that was revealed it, like a lot of people including myself was like okay but can we really trust Peter but you know now we actually heard it from her that she did kill Jessica which you know that was sad but um yeah we're going into the finale the season finale of next week why does that make me want to cry thinking about it it really makes me want to cry thinking about it like i know that's probably lame because it's only a tv show but you know it's been a part of my life for so long and like saying goodbye to it is like it makes me sad because i've met so much great people throughout the fandom and made me on tv you know but yeah this is um goodbye you know next week i'm not ready but i'm also ready to find out who ad is and i hoping it's spencer's twin um or even aria's twin but i'm mostly hoping for spencer's twin at this point um but yeah what do you think of the episode not much really to recap on it was kind of just like okay here we go with you know some filler stuff and it was pre pretty predictable in my opinion it was good i enjoyed it pretty little liars collab video with a few other pretty little liar youtubers it's gonna go um keep an eye for that thanks for watching and i'll see you guys later bye guys peace out